Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, welcome. My name is Pebbles. So today I'm organizing my linen closet in my master bathroom. It's very cluttered. It doesn't have the aesthetic that I'm looking for. So I figured I could take you guys along, show you guys the process and the materials that I got. So if you're interested in seeing that, check out my video. So this is the before look of my closet and it's not bad. Um, simply because I keep most of like my beauty and um, hygiene stuff under my sink in my bathroom and I'll do a video on that organization another time. Um, but I know you're probably thinking where are all your towels and they're actually being washed so they're in the dryer right now. But the wire shelving, I just cannot get with wire shelving um, and I just wanna cover that. So we're gonna go ahead and get started and get it done. So the first stop was a quick trip to Home Depot. Here, I needed to get the wood to cover the wire shelves. So we headed over to the wood aisle and this is the wood panel I decided on. Unfortunately, there weren't a lot of options to choose from, but I felt like this would go perfect with my hardwood floors. So rather than measuring my shelves at home, I want it to be on the safe side. So I decided to bring my shelves into Home Depot so they could measure them. I picked out the perfect wood panel and the guy in the back is cutting them out. Okay, so I got everything out of my linen closet and I'm gonna show you some of the things that I picked up at Target. So I got this wooden basket, um, this wooden storage basket from Target. It is from the Threshold Collection. Um, so what I'm gonna do here is just roll up some white linen or white like hand towels and just keep them in this basket. And I did get two of these. I really don't know the price of it, but I'm gonna try to link it down below. Okay, so the next thing that I have is this glass jar that I got from Marshalls. A couple, either Marshalls or Home Goods, that I got a couple years ago. I actually have three of these glass jars in different sizes. So for this jar, I just have some soap, some Dove soap. My taller jar, I have Epsom salt, and then my tallest jar, I just have some bath bombs. I figured this would be really cute just to have as a display on my shelves. So the next basket I got from Target as well, it's the same as the, um, the wooden storage basket that I just recently showed you. Um, this is just going to be the basket that I use for like my towels or my dirty rags. I do have a laundry basket for my clothes, but I needed something that was separate. And this fits perfectly. It's really easy to um, pick up when I take it to my laundry room and I just felt like it was the perfect size for my closet. Okay, so the next thing that I picked up from Target was this wire basket. It says it's from the Hearth and Hand with Magnolia collection. Um, I just keep my toilet paper in these. I feel like this is, would be like a really cute display. Um, and what I like is that it has handles, easy to pick up, grab and go. So I needed something floral or some type of plant in my closet and sticking with like the white and black and wooden type of thing. I just wanted to pick out something simple. These flowers, I already had a pattern for a couple years and I just decided, you know, let me just see what it looks like in my closet. So the next thing I got from Target were these towels. This is from, I think the Great Bay Home um, collection and I did get some hand towels to match. And I really needed a towel that was just, it had a really good fabric or feel to it. I like the cotton feel of it. And so the last thing that I got from Target was this wire basket. And what I like about it is that it does have like this white cloth liner um, on it. So it's a little bit different than the other wire bas basket that I have. Unfortunately, as I was trying to size everything and try to change or decide which shelf I wanted it on. As you can see, I already did it. But whatever, we're gonna work with it. Um, so I will say the cloth or this sheet that is on it is very thin and it easily rips. Um, and this is from the Room Essentials, and that's why it rips, because Room Essentials isn't the best quality. But I just keep a lot of my 
miscellaneous things in this basket. My um, my sheets, some of my pillowcases, my blow dryer, my apron, my <laughs> mattress cover. I just keep a lot of stuff in here. So I'm gonna try to go ahead and get everything organized and I'll see you soon. So what I'll probably end up doing is painting my wood panels simply because it's kind of clashing with my hardwood floors and I want like a solid brown color. So now is the fun part. I'm organizing everything to my liking. That first crate came in handy. It was perfect for all of my miscellaneous items that just really didn't go together. So initially my closet had five shelves, but I did have to remove a shelf to put in my laundry basket and it was wide enough to have my laundry basket and that short wooden storage basket to put my dirty towels in. So guys, I really think these white bath towels just really elevates this closet compared to the colored towels that I had before. And I'm just finishing putting up the baskets and my plants. And y'all, this is how the closet turned out. Oh, I'm doing a little bit more. I forgot I did that. <laughs> I'm just a perfectionist, y'all. But this is how the closet turned out. I'm just super obsessed and I'm really thinking about painting that back wall. Tell me guys what you think. So I hope you guys like my linen closet organization video. Remember to give this video a thumbs up. And please subscribe to my channel. We are constantly growing and I appreciate the support. And hit that bell for notifications so you know every time I upload. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.